I mean, that's the strength with mobile telephony. Because you, talk, you want to have a personal communication, an individual you want to talk to. So, so I think it's going to shift. So the future is going to be basically uh, um, data access based voice with presence detection and with uh, the ability to uh, uh, to do you know various different things including video over over yeah i mean i think where is the internet heading the internet is heading more and more into pictures and video tv and here we're on the risk of clogging down the internet because with the increased bandwidth you have in, on the access side, you want to have a bottleneck on, on the transport side. And with, with services like Yahoo, more and more broadcasting channels putting up their programs on the internet. I mean, I think today you probably can get free of charge some 50 to 100 or perhaps even more TV channels over the internet. When that's starting to become big, it's it's going to be a challenge. Does Tele2 have any uh, backbone assets in, in Europe? That it yeah, I mean, if you look at our... I think the, the offer or the services that we have in uh, Holland is probably the most advanced in the world. We have a complete nationwide triple play offer, digital IPTV, we have four really big uh, uh, video farms where people, when they subscribe to our services, they can watch uh, the 8 o'clock news at 8.10 or 8.50 or 8.30. You can rewind, you can replay, you can do slow motion when you watch uh, football, ice hockey, direct broadcasting. I mean, these type of services exist today take up is a bit slow but these type of things come what do you see happening in Latvia so you left the fixed networks uh, do you see uh, uh, mobile uh, t TV as a future uh, service on the platform these it's going to be there but I don't think it's going to be a block blockbuster uh, I think I mean if you take I think you can kill some time watching some streamed video. I don't think you're ever going to spend two hours watching a uh, movie. I don't I mean, Very few people are going to do that. Perhaps you will do it with a uh, modem card or a modem to a PC. How about location based services? I believe in that. I, I'm a bit uh, disappointed that it's not taking off uh, faster. I think it has a lot of uh, potential. I think you can do a lot of really funny things with location-based services. Uh, question is how the consumer uh, going to react to it, because I, I have tons of ideas on how to use, play, or tie advertising to location-based services and uh, offers and, and things like that. I mean, you can give vouchers when you buy, go, let's say you go um, past a bar. You can have a voucher in your phone, say, uh, pay for one beer, get two, Heineken, for instance. Uh, getting back to the data, uh, the IT support in Latvia, uh, so far it's back office, but some of these things like LBS and uh, some of the uh, payment systems and all kinds of mobile content, uh, are you also looking for people who can develop that out of the Latvian IT community? Not. Presently, I mean, we have had some companies in in the Baltic region that we have uh, wanted development from, but uh, uh, I mean, we do tenders when we do certain things, and if there are are uh, good Latvian companies, they're going to be invited. But not spec I mean, that's not why we are there. We said building up, we setting up this uh, IT operation center. It's going to grow. It's going to take over system by system. Uh, but of course, it's a challenge to to. Employ people, train people, etc. So, so uh, mm -hmm. but this is basically a, a, a service when the ser when a server goes down in uh, Belgium, uh, the people in Latvia will figure out why and will tell them what to do. Yeah. Uh, but when you want to develop a mobile voucher distribution system, uh, who are you going to turn to then? 
Well, I mean, if we don't if we don't have uh, a supplier already, then we're going to go out on tender. Okay. Then we look for for. I mean, today we have uh, really two main suppliers. So what we're trying to do today is, is uh, standardize, reuse. So we have a standard concept, and we have that very much when it comes to billing, you know, postpaid, prepaid. When it comes to web uh, platforms, when it comes to uh, internet platforms, and we want to take that on also on the, the broadband side and move that more and more into to, uh, RIG as well.